Mental Hearing Enhancement initialized. Neural Feedback Status Green. Helmet Uplink established. Personal Interface Initialization complete. Doctor. Doctor, can you hear me? Augmented Reality Module now. There's 2,000 people facing certain death right now, unless we help them. My feelings are not a priority. That may be true, Doctor, but these people's well-being happens to depend on yours. I'm fine. Just give me an update about the situation in here. The human activity monitor shows a 4.30% drop over the course of your surgery. So, that's 87 more people who potentially went missing. We need to hurry. Be that as it may, Doctor, we still need to test your implants before we proceed. Fine. Let's just get it over with. Hold the scan button to activate scan mode. NER VR will interpret your optical signals and locate useful objects for you. It will use this to display relevant data. Your PI will automatically attempt to connect and hack any hardware you scan. You can perform a number of useful actions in this manner. You can also use scan mode to find solutions to tricky situations. I see that your NER VR 2.0 interface is now online. Your condition is acceptable, which means we can proceed with the mission. Is Neil still near the secondary entrance? Mr. Wilder's last login was half an hour ago. Okay. I'll stop by to see him before we go in. Yes, of course. As you wish. To use one of your colorful expressions, Doctor, shall we get cracking? I will be here if you need backup. Yep, let's go. We've kept Neil waiting long enough. Remarkably fast. The Nerve VR has clearly enhanced your abilities. This thing feels crazy intuitive, like I have a superpower or something.
Doctor, this elevator appears out of order. However, you can simply get close to the edge and jump over. Do not worry about the drop. Your suit will protect you. None of our simulations show how a virus could take over such an advanced facility as here, much less in 48 hours. So how did Red do it? Red's an advanced virus, designed to be compatible with more. That's all we know. How does it work? Who built it? How is it so effective? I don't have the answers to any of those questions yet, but it's endangering the lives of the world's greatest scientists by locking them up in here and messing with the life support system. So, we're going to have to save them. Nothing else matters. Of course. I will help the best I can. Where's Neil? Why would he leave? I told him it's safer to stay put and wait. I cannot reach him through his PI either. Do you think he is in danger, Doctor? Hmm, hope not. Interesting. Mr. Wilder has built a survivor tracking tool. Doctor, it appears Mr. Wilder interfaced with his laptop recently. He... let me see... He watched a video. Did he do anything else? There is a network log entry after the video, but it appears corrupted. Show me the video. Good morning, citizens of the Institute. 
This was captured from a NerVR live feed half an hour ago. Mr. Wilder likely went to find the survivor. It is quite a way from here. Guess we'll have to make it to the Genie Activation Hub without him. Inside. That is a favorable outcome. You will now need to take the elevator back to the facility. Be careful, Doctor. The whole circuit appears to be out of commission. You will need access to the control room if you are to restore power. Wait! That genie is infected with the red virus. No matter what you do, Doctor, stay out of its line of sight.
Doctor, I found something we can use. If you boost the power of this e-grabber, you could use it to trigger a localized EMP discharge that would disable genies up close. That's some nice lateral thinking, Oz. I'm impressed. Genie is blocking the path ahead. This is the perfect opportunity to test your E-Blaster. Is this what we're calling it now? Or you could get behind it and scan its code in order to turn it off. This will take longer, but it will spare your E-Blaster's battery. Okay, E-Blaster it is.
Accessing security profile. Class 1 security profile found. Welcome back to here, Dr. Thomas Liu. The Heuristic Emergency Response Environment, or HEAR, has gathered over 2,000 of the world's greatest minds to shape its evolution. All of them are working in concert to forge humanity's brightest possible tomorrow. The future is here.